It's Riff Arcade. I'm Josh. The man on the other side is Butts, and I am yep. playing Pilot Wing 64. Uh, I, lo <laughs> I love this soundtrack, man. <laughs> I feel like it was recorded using slap bass, like slap guitar, and slap keyboards. <laughs> Some slap drums. <laughs> Everyone's at their instruments. The soundtrack slaps, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Okay, so this is one of my favorite things to do in this game. It took me forever to figure out how to do this as a kid, but once I got it under my hands, it's it's one of my favorite things to do. It's the Dark Cavern Test for the Rocket Belt. So, without further ado, watch this. <laughs> Last time he said that he plummeted into the ground. That's true. <laughs> Hopefully it won't happen this time. So yes, oh, I game. entered this dark cavern. So the game was like, here, here's hard mode. Yeah. So you think you're good with the jetpack. <laughs> yeah. They say like tight in the top. That's correct, bud. T for, T for top. Is, he, is there any other geological information you'd like to teach our video game audience? <laughs> um, the torches seem unrealistic, but that's about it. <laughs> I wonder if I can get scorched. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I, I wish they would scream. <laughs> good to know, good to know. Ooh. And it's an Ooh. underwater cavern! Ooh, yeah. Like just going along and then boop, cavern. This is one of my favorite things about the N64 as a whole. It's just these, like, so many N64 games, like, um, Shadows of the Empire did this too. They would just have these areas you could just explore for no reason. I love the detail in this game. It's so good. I would do chef kissy fingers right now, but I would die <laughs> instantly. Thank you. In. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Whoop. 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 steady hand. Don't touch the sides. <laughs> there you go. There you go. It's the operation. There's one ring to fly through. Yep, that's it. Go! Go! I thought I was going to miss it. Just like... <laughs> 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 Dang it. I'm nice. do it again. <laughs> So that's that. That is my favorite thing to do. Was that stressful? Like, was it a stress reliever? Or were you just like, oh, this is hard. This is fun. It was, it was stressful learning to do it. But once I figured out how to do it, it was stress relief. Like, it feels really good to do that. All right. What? I said... Okay, I was gonna go straight to Birdman, but I remembered there's one more thing I couldn't do without showing you on this game. And it is the ultimate test in missile marksmanship. <laughs> so Hawk, go this on. guy I've been playing as this whole time, right? Well, this is Mecha Hawk. Those gray pixels on the horizon will soon look like something. And it's throwing rocks oh, at me. God, he's fighting you, yeah. And it's Mega Hawk. <laughs> so it is. <laughs> oh, oh, you're actually fighting now, okay. So we are fighting. <laughs> it's a little boss battle, kinda. <laughs> it's the closest thing to a boss battle, yeah. <laughs> Same, buddy. Same. <laughs> Where are you fighting in the United States? This is on the Great Plains at this point. So this is ah, like... Uh, yeah, all the, all the farms. You know, Kansas, Nebraska, Iowa. It's not much, but it's honest living. <laughs> hey, again, Georgia got a gas station, so... <laughs> yes. There's St. Louis. See the St. Louis Arch? How does it St. Louis Arch? Thread that needle. Yeah, yeah. Hi, St. Louis. I've never been to There's St. Chicago. Louis. I'm sorry, I keep cutting you off. Yes, I have never been to St. Louis either. 
My wife says I would really like Chicago, and I want to go one day. But that means getting on a plane, and that's not fun. <laughs> Is it bad that you said Chicago, and I immediately thought hot dogs? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 that's what they're known for. <laughs> and a pizza. Although I don't know, like... What do, you, what do you think of Chicago pizza? Do you count that as pizza, or is that like a big lasagna casserole or something? I, I don't, I don't, I don't really know the last time I've had like a real Chicago deep dish. So I've, I've never really had one. Can't weigh in on that. So here's my question to you. Oh, um, speaking of Americana, and um, and he's dead. <laughs> yeah. And you saved us, Josh. Okay. Whoops, sorry. Let <laughs> 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 <That> one fly. <laughs> green smoke! Green smoke! Green smoke! <laughs> da -na -na -na, da -na -na. <laughs> the rock. <laughs> There's your uh, Americana. You've saved us, Josh. You've killed us! Yes, so... <laughs> speaking of Americana... Um, my question to you is, uh, speaking of, like... You know, like Philadelphia, Chicago, just like American history. Um, I don't know how you feel about this, but I generally find American history to be just the worst in that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, first off, there's only 200 odd years of it. So there's not even that much compared to other countries around the world. But I mean, you look yeah. at like. Japan and they have like dragons, dragon carvings and like shrines in the middle of the woods and just like pagodas and architecture and like even like India you look at like oh, God, Taj India. Mahal which which has you know this, this very unique cultural building and like this different religion and it could just be that I'm from America, and so it I just take it for granted and it just washes over me. But yeah, I just I feel like you like be I'll be Robin. Oh yeah. I feel like <laughs> easy Robin. <laughs> American history could be cooler. Oh, Sorry, yeah. I didn't mean to do that twice, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. I'll do cloud. Yeah, I mean it it is boring. We don't have like super old buildings. Um, we don't have any, you, you, except for the Wild West, there's nothing, there's no period of history in America where it's just like, oh, that's iconic, and that's what you think of. Mm -hmm. We've also got the whole slavery thing, so that's not a great thing to go back and remember. Yeah, not, not um, proud of that. Yeah, I mean, like you said, we're only 200, 200, 250 years old. We're not very old, so we don't have anything to fall back on. And also think about you... You think about all those other cultures, um, like they just had time to develop, and we built up our country at a time where, after the Industrial Revolution, so everything was about convenience and money and stuff like that. Whereas back then, they were like, we need to build a temple. Everyone in the village, let's build this temple. And they would do it, and they were like, all right, we're going to take care of this temple for the next 500 years because it's our temple. And in America, we're just like, yeah, we built a house 20 years ago. Let's knock it down. It's fine. Like we just yeah. don't really care. There's Nessie. Nah, you missed it. That's <laughs> probably why the Civil War. Everyone studies the Civil War. So it's like, yeah, it's actually somewhat interesting in American True. history. It's like, yeah, we had a bunch of fighting. True. That was cool. Our wars are the most interesting thing about our history. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, that's depressing to think of. But yeah. <laughs> we do uh, have the Wild West, though, and I mean, like. True. That's something that everyone around the world is like, oh yeah, when they think of America, they think of cowboys and you know, shootouts at the OK Corral and stuff like that. That's that's our iconic thing. So this is the uh, Georgia exit that I've continuously mentioned in this series. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. It is. It is a gas station interstate highway. <laughs> I have seen so many exit. of those exits in Georgia. <laughs> yeah, oh my gosh. <laughs> I-16. <laughs> I-16, yep, yep. But yeah, I guess that's true. I think one point you kind of started to make is I think religion makes for interesting cultures. And um, yes, America was founded on a religion, but not like 
Not in the way other cultures are. <laughs> With like shrines and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Just just sprouting out of the woods, like I said. Yeah. Yeah, America was founded around a time where like travel was kind of not the worst. Like you couldn't you could travel, but yeah, you had carts and, and buggies and horses and stuff like that, but it wasn't, it wasn't like, well, this is our village. We're cut off from the, the world because we live high in the mountains of Japan and no one's ever coming here, so. True. It was like, oh, I want to go from Philadelphia to New York. Okay, it'll take me a day and a half, but I can do it. Yeah. Well, and like you said, everything is... Everything was much more convenient by the time America was founded as opposed to most of these other countries. So it makes sense that all our buildings are just brick and you know, at right angles, because that's structure. That's <laughs> yeah. That's the best way to build buildings. <laughs> yeah, it's not like, hey, this building's been around for ten generations. Let's keep it around, because it's been around for ten generations. It was like, oh, that building was built 80 years ago. Are we using it? We're not using it? Okay, tear it down. Like, we just... Yeah. There's some old stuff, but it's not, it's not what it was. Yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, uh, something very interesting has happened, and actually something that I had hoped would happen, and that is um, we've just kind of started talking about interesting things, not necessarily video game related, um, but still slightly video game related, uh, with the backdrop of this beautiful, soothing music and me just <laughs> flying around the little states, and... Um, Butts has come to me before about uh, maybe just wanting to do like podcast episodes and that kind of thing. And uh, so, Butts, I present to you. I think we can use this as a podcast format, even if like if we just want to play a game and uh, just have something going on while we just talk about stuff. And uh, you folks at home weigh in on this too. I want to know what y'all think about this, but um. But would you or the audience uh, be interested in just doing episodes where we just do Pilot Wing 64 Birdman and just talk about stuff? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and fly around. Yeah. Would it would it really just sink your ship if I was like, nah, not really. <laughs> I mean, you can. I mean, you can say that. I mean, yeah, no, no. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm in. Because it's just... Yeah, this music, man, just gets you, like, lost, and you're just like, I, I can think, I can focus. Yeah. Hollywood. Yeah, it's, um... <laughs> yeah, no, I'm all in. Awesome. <laughs> God, music. Then that might happen again soon. We might just have some, uh... Some riff casts, or some, uh... Pod arcades. Pod, pod, <laughs> pod riffs, yeah. Or, <laughs> pod or riff... Kids... Cades. Pod or cattle. <laughs> Is that the Golden Gate Bridge? Or is that supposed to be? I think it is, although it's, it's not as to scale as some of the other things are in this game. Much faster like the, than be. Um, the space, space needle, needle over here. Yep, we are in Seattle now. We just flew from San Francisco to Seattle in two seconds. I bet you folks wish you could do that. <laughs> the needle. Can you land on the needle? You sure can. Oh, I'm sure you've yeah. tried all that right Yes, yeah, silly like goose. Whoop, whoops, whoops, nope. whoops. No. <laughs> You've killed her! <laughs> Came in a little hard. Okay, well, yeah, uh, you folks at home, let us know what you think of that idea. Uh, we might we might do that in the near future. Um, I, you know what? There's one last thing I wanted to say. I'll jump back in. Um, and the, la the last thing I wanted to talk about was just... Um, this game also gave me a love for cloudy days. Because, I mean, if it's raining, that stinks. And if it's, you know, just really nasty looking and he I'm foggy, like, that's one thing. But when you have days like this where it's clear, like, it's really clear, but then just you just have this, like, carpet of clouds just way <laughs> high up. I love that, man. Like, I could just sit on the porch and just be in that. My wife can't stand cloudy days, but if the clouds are just right, I'm like... Yes, <laughs> this is awesome. I love this weather. That's interesting. No, I'm. I want clouds in the sky, but no, I want some blue and something to look at. 
Like I love the days where like it's super bright and sunny and the sky is really blue and there's a handful of clouds in the sky and they're all like super white. Yes. I like that. Like the toy like the wallpaper in Andy's room in Toy Story. Yeah. That kind like of they're thing. way up there or something like that. And you're just like, ah, I'm just gonna watch the clouds, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and I mean, I like oh, the sunny you, days, too. Did you get applauded? Wait, 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 I did. did you get applauded? Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, if you thread needles, you'll get applauded. So, like, Was that the, the people in St. Louis Arch applauding you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> they're, just up in the, they're just up in the arch, and they see... Are there any windows in the arch? I have no idea. Yeah, I think but, so. I think there's, like, an observation deck or something. I don't know. Yeah. People in St. Louis, tell us. Woo! There we go. Okay, I was like, no claps for that one. <laughs> All right. Okay. On that note, um, I think that's going to do it for our uh, Pilot Wing 64 series. We hope you enjoyed it. Um, yes, we might podcast to Birdman, but we, I probably won't advertise that as a Pilot Wing 64 video. I'll probably just say like, you know, Birdman, whatever. That's all in the air right now. Let us know in the comments how you want it to happen. And um, that's it. We love you all. Uh, give us a like if you like this series. Um, tell all your friends about it. And we will see you folks on the next episode of Riff Arcade. Yeah. I almost don't want to talk. This music's really good. It's so soothing. Oh, it's so I good. need this music. Yeah. Keyboards, go, go play this for me. Uh oh. <laughs>